So here's the thing. Hillary Clinton performs political tasks in exchange for money. Now, I think we can all agree that that's true. Um, if we're going to um, have a debate about this, um, you know, we can do that. But I, I think that um, it would be rather disingenuous. Um, I think it's pretty clear that that's what Hillary Clinton does. She does tasks on a political spectrum in exchange for money. Now, considering that that's the case, I'm having a hard time understanding the pushback against the idea that she might be a corporate whore, because that's it's the literal definition of what a corporate whore would be. And I'm sorry, but no amount of hurt feelings, feigned or real, will change that. Stating the truth is more important than protecting your feelings. And the more offensive the truth is, the more important it is to state it. So please do not be silenced by the language police. It doesn't matter how upset they are. It doesn't matter how many times they yell at you. If something is true, then it is true. And it is very important that you hold to that. That said, you might try and reclaim the term if you want. You might argue that it's not so terrible to be a corporate whore. That's really what her candidacy reduces to, right? The argument that taking all of this money in exchange for services may benefit people. It might trickle down. But don't pretend like it's inaccurate, or worse, like it's okay to silence true words because they hurt your feelings. That's not a valid argument. To put it another way, the truth hurts sometimes. And you have to deal with that, not me. Sorry. <laughs>